So the Gemara, let's begin. The last piece of the Maimur quotes the Gemara again. So just get the all of my days. Just check us with the first line, mark them down, I'm done with my base. Huh? Yeah. Huh? I'm at all this. Okay, yeah. All right. So the Gemara says all kinds of instructions about how one approaches davening. And then the Gemara says, Tana Mori bar beria de rav hunda beria de rav yirmiya bar av. Al yipater ad mechaveri al mitech dvar alach ha shemitech kach sechrei. Then tells the story of Rav Kahana, who was accompanying Rav Simi Barashi in a journey in Bavel. When they got there, so he said to him, Rav Kahana said to Rav Simi, is it true that which people say that the date palms in Bovel after the time of Adam Arish until now? To which he replied, you reminded me of the teaching of Rabbi Yosef Rabbi Hanina. And then he brings the teaching of Rabbi Yosef Rabbi Hanina about this Pasuk in Yirmiya. The Pasuk says, describing the journey in the desert, No man passed through it, no man uh, settled it. Nobody traveled through it, obviously it wasn't settled. Then he answers this answer, that the Odom first Odom Barishan, that every place that he was going and settled, every place they didn't go, he was not settled. So the first man actually pointed out over there, so that he takes leave of him there. The whole point was that he, he accompanied him and took leave of him. He didn't tell him about Allah. He didn't tell him about Allah, he told him this, this word. So, Lechudah, the Maimah, answers that question to us. So let's begin, Because uh, uh, the whole dik of the Maimah is the Dafka Halacha, right? Which is the Ratzon Elian, the Ratzon Atzmi, higher than uh, all the other Dargis of Torah, as we explained yesterday. He doesn't tell him the Halacha. The Gemara concludes the whole discussion with this story. Gemara. We have a stick of beer here. So let's begin. So the Gemara concludes the whole account, the whole uh, din. Well, you put it Adam with, he said to him, at the Karta Milsi, you reminded me of something. And he taught him that teaching. Called the editor, God's Allah, Adam Adishal Yishav Nisyashva. The whole editor, God's Allah, Adam Adishal Yishav Nisyashva. So what's the Indian? parts of Ak. goes on parts of the face, literally of Adam Kadman, which is the first darga, the first level where Hashem articulates Machshava and so on, the whole purpose, vision, plan of creation. Gzeda is Adam Marishan, and what's the Gzeda? That's the Machshava Akdum the Ak. In other words, the Rotten Atzmi. Behind the whole Maisa Bni Adam Vinyanehem, which means that all of man's deeds, Vinyanehem, everything of life, of history, in Mapi Akzeri Dash Gochel Yenik, if you show the Bamachshav Akdumadak, are all according to the supernal Akzeri, 
as it arose in the Machshova Akduma Da'ak, literally the primal thought of Adam Kadma. So Lukhari this is the Ratsan Atsmi, and that's why it's in these two in Yonim of settle or don't settle. The Proteus here says, but said they say fan him, so in detail there's two fan him. That it should go all the other Mirish Lisha when he's Yashva. That it shall go all the other Mirish Lisha when he's Yashva. That which he decrees. So these are the Xayas. These are the, the, the final halacha, which is, which is Xayas, ultimately. Hide and Seichel. So this brings in the Gidim Achlekes of Beisham Beisilo. The Gemara says, why was the halacha like Beisilo? Not like Beisham, right? So there's two uh, views or two cases. One is the approach of the majority. And the second was that they were uh, uh, forgo, for, would forgo their COVID and were pleasant and allowed Beishamah to speak first. So Chassidus answers, that's a reason to pass in Allah because they're nice people. If you, if you answer because a uh, majority or because of the Svoda was, was, was found to be more... Uh, Better, that's a reason that it should be the Allah like them. But the answer is that the Tafke Bittl, that's the Kaili for the Rots and Atzmi. It's not in Yin of Seichel. Sof Kosof, what is the Avish to want the Pearl, Mamish, in terms of making this Yashwa to settle the world and make a Dirabet Achtoinim and draw on his essence in the same way that his essence is beyond obviously Seichel. So, too, the Kaili for that is the is a Bittl, Tafke, Neuchen, Veluvin, Hayu. And that is Mamshir and the Galda the Rotsan area. And that's the Xayda we're speaking here of Admarish's Xaydas, huh? Which which uh, and it's okay. Which uh, leaves open to be explained to the Osir Lov Mashiach comes to Allah as a Bishama. What about this property of Bittl to Machavan to the Rats and the Elyon? Anyway, that's for another, another uh, discussion. Not sure the answer to that. Could be basically based on the Bittl first, like Dom of Bittl, like Nasev and Nishma. Then, after the Bittl, then we're ready for the Atat Tzavah to permeate that Bittl, permeate all the Dargis and the, the, the depth. Huh? Right, yeah. It, it's hard to say that, that Shammai is Metzias and not Bittl, but relative, that's, that's what it says, relative to Hill, it's a Dargin Alikus, but not the Darg of Bittl of, of Hillel. It's true, it's, it's a manifested level. Shammai was sharper. Okay. So what's it to find in Aveda, we're, we're visiting Ishes. I'm just wondering also that the Gemara doesn't say this, but this, the Gemara concludes, I have the story, you reminded me of something, he said. Could be that, that uh, his Muramas here, that this is a Chreinus that he spoke about earlier. Phenibius Chetzenius has explained earlier, which is which is what this is all all about. Is Dvar <clears throat> So the two I found in Mavid Boifin Shalchia, but Sadatoiv. So there's the the affirmative Sadatoiv, or the Kimitz to say, or Mavid Boifin Shalchia, but Sadahovchi, and then the Shlila, which is not doing in the opposite the opposite Avoid. The Shemitas Mitzvah Shleis Asa. Do good, turn from evil into good. And the general context of these two lands, settle and not settle, which we explained. It's all part, it's all the Gzeda Dashgoch Al so the Ashgo, what, what's the Ashgoch El Yoyin over here? The Gzeda. Hashem decrees, do this, don't do that. What's the Ashgoch? Huh? 
So that's Goncha is, is he goes on to explain. Hashem's providence. Simple pshat in the Pasuk. It's the Pasuk can tell him from, from Hashem, the steps of a giver are directed. Rashi explains a giver means someone who does mitzvahs. Strong person means Baruchnius. The darker yechpots, and he desires his way. Now, this can be read two ways, as we see now in the square brackets. There's no teaching the Mashem of the Altareb on the Posuk. Shakesh, Yehudi, Bol, the Mokim is Suya. And what now you're in there? The person comes to a certain place. Huh? Yeah. No, it's just a youth Thomas. Oh, you're right. And you doubt the They are, you don't, you still know it's still to come. But you're right. It talks about in the Tzutzik Dusha and the Tzadik, you see it. And yeah, that's, there's that there, that there also. The Dashkar Khalil leads one that's interesting that he doesn't bring that. Maybe there that doesn't quote the Vashem Tev and the Alter Rebbe or the Alter Rebbe. Does it? I don't think so. So, so what do they say when a yid comes to a place? All of the das has to know. said that He brought him there. He thinks he's going for his business, vacation. He got lost, whatever it is. So, Hashem is Hashem directs the, the, the steps of man. So the kavana is whose way? The simple uh, reading the pasuk is v'darke echbots. Hashem desires his ways. Hashem is designing the ways of the person. Here, the kavon is Kadesh, Darkish, Kadesh, Baruch, Yech, but the person should desire Hashem's way and carry out his will there. Kirill, Gamma, Pidush, Dark, Yach, Kadesh, Baruch, and that includes a second type, which will be the first one. The David should desire his way. So in other words, if you do what Hashem wants, and Hashem is desired, then what you're doing. So it's both ways. But the ikad of the Pesach is to bring out that Hashem directs the steps of man. That's that's gocha part. That's integral to the gzeda. The gzeda is the mitzvahs. Well, where are we going to do them? So Hashem directs us wherever you end up. That's where you need to do these two-way fandom of Yishuv and not Yishuv. Mitzvah sase, mitzvah slay sase. Yeah. So getting the flow of the pasuk, Hashem directs the steps of man. To grant success to every person, each individual, because each one, right? I mean, it's not all that's got a protest of our individual lives. And all those material matters, but they lahashni makavon el yon el lis liyos. To carry out the divine intent, that it should be referring here to the, the original light that Hashem created and hid away, which is revealed through Taira, the here Lamata, which is the Kavan. So, that, uh, so to suggest, the, the, explanation, the connection, therefore, between the two in Yonim, in this Maimar Azal. This is actually what you raised yesterday, the question, why not mitzvahs? Why not mitzvahs? So here, she is a chreyo, in order to talk that there should be a chreyo. So this story is adding that we must speak limited dvar halacha. It's not enough just to teach a halacha, which is in speech, we have to bring it out. Uh, uh, it's a pasuk. Life to those who bring it out, says the Gemara and the the pair who articulate Teira and uh, Tfila verbally. So that's not, not enough to think it, but that's not enough either. Dvar halacha. It's not the Kvetch. The Kvetch is that, it's, that he told him something. In addition to going from Mashav al Dibur, he reminded me, he says, of this story because he wants to tell them it's got to come in Avoida, like Kayim Gzaydas, Od Marishim Machol, that is the Fiyin Yon. That is the Demar Allah should be actually 
implemented and realized and to carry out the, this, the story of other Madishan in the appropriate way. The Yishev, Shaloi Le Yishev. Compared to Rosh Hashanah, this, now this actually affirms the Remez, and he reminded me, because look what he says now. Like, like Rosh Hashanah, Shlei Maspik, Amiris, Pesukim, Zichreines. It's not enough just to remember by saying the Pesukim, to invoke that. That's Torah, Pesukim Torah. That's like the Dvar Halacha. And it's not a chit. Gam in a Maisa, we also do the Maisa. Shazel Emri Bameda, how does the Gemara conclude and how is this all affected that you make me king over you, Bameda Beshoifer? Who Baruch Bamarim Shift, as we explained at length in the Mamorim previously, the Mamor of Shoshana, that you need the Maisa Bapel of the Shoifer as well. So it's Dibur and even Maisa. So is the, there is the Maisa. In other words, they should carry out the Halacha. What halacha? It's the same, just like I said, whatever is appropriate in your place. It's a very broad, now we get a very, very broad understanding of this whole exchange. Which halacha? The halacha you need to do. Bashgacha pratis in that place where you are. So it comes out, it's far beyond the narrow meaning of teaching a particular halacha. The Indian, the Indian of Halacha, of Halicha and Maisa Bepoyo. It was the same, it was just like said, pardon? Yeah. 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 What happens on Shabbos? We don't mind what happens on Shabbos, but uh, yeah, it has to be the Maisa Bepoyo. And even on Shabbos, we, we, we do both the second day. We don't. Uh, person shouldn't take leave of his fellow uh, only out of the Allah through which he remembers him. So the beautiful Moshe brought in Samach Vav Moshe and Ben Melech explained in the Shalom Shlichus Lamata. Moshe of the Prince Shoshel Chaya Melech Harhek Mimeno the King sends him far away to the Lagal. What's the Kavanah? He sends him, he sends him to, uh, to uh, actually it's based on a medrash, to an undeveloped Medina Chareva, and he's got the shlichas there to bring the culture and to develop the, that place. So the Emisha, the Pnimi Sakavona is not the place, it's, it's, the, it's the sun. It's an oil to bring out his talents and strengths and what he's able to affect. And therefore, you have to give him something that, you, that the bond should remain. This is the Chris's bris. Until they will see each other again. Because the Kavan is not to send them away, and that's the end of the story. The Kavan is to be connected to the Melech in a much deeper way, and therefore the, he gives them the tools by which this can happen. Like he says in the Maimah, the Impetus. Shazel had var alocha, they used to give the yid the var alocha, say the mitzvahs, but alocha, and maisa bepoel, mitzvahs. Shemotech kach zechreihu, through which the, the, the memory is never lost. The bond is forever there. Or, the, or as he's explained till now, the pinimis dike connection, the zikodon, uh, embraces the chetzonis dike connection. And the day is that it's like var alocha, Emotional words here. That's a, the, the the fact that they through the fact that Eibush gives everybody this gift that var alocha. That's given to every neshama. Borud adovo shleidach amen and yidach. It's absolutely clear that no Jew is pushed away forever. And the years echrei who he remember him. Ad she yachsedul v'yisro until they will see each other again. This reminds me of a story. I'm a little hazy on some of the detail, but the Nakuda of the story is this. There was a Yid, his name was Abiel Itkin. I'm not mistaken, related to the Itkin Mishpach, I'm going to talk, ask uh, Levi, he would know. And uh, Lubavitcher, so he left, he left Russia fairly early and settled in that saw it looks like in the 20s, maybe even earlier. He got involved there in uh, whatever it was, Zionism, and uh, it became estranged a little bit from his uh, his roots 
This is talking now that Fidik ever came to it, so 1929. So he was torn. He wanted very much wanted to see him, but he was embarrassed to see him. He worked at the post office in Tel Aviv, if I'm not mistaken. So uh, there's some some detail here with construction going on. Anyway, so I, as I recall the story, so he was struggling with himself. So he decided he's going to, which was common then, you know, these short khaki pants, They're not that short, but uh, wearing. He's not going to go to the feet to get up in. Uh, so, he, so he wore those pants, which he wore, I guess, regularly anyway. Not that he didn't have another pair, but but Lepeil, Lepeil, when the feet giver was there, and also I think the detail was that there was still there was traffic things, and and uh, and notwithstanding that, he shows up. So the feet giver ever said to him, "Mendreitzich, mendreitzich, b'mezatzich." You turn this way, you turn that way, but again we see each other again. We wander, we wander. The end. So what I'm saying over here, to Dova Boru, that we will see each other again. That the whole separation, the whole symptom, that all began with the symptom of This is not the. This is not the uh, the way things are to remain. God forbid. It's all only that Mizazach Zen. And these actually the words that, as we all know, that are used at the end of the Basilegani Maimon. This is exactly the. Yeah. Chassidim. Chassidim, what's, what's their final words when they uh, take leave of each other? Tired of being the precious brothers, we see each other again. They wish for the heaven, but the heaven is not in heaven. As a child growing up in Australia, this was a very big, uh, this Nigan was a, a, a big, I don't know how to describe it, but it was a very, uh, like it's a, it's a marker in our lives, because living so far away, when Chassidim would go to the Rebbe, when the Shluchim would come and go back, everybody, the whole community went out to the airport. And this was very emotional. This was the, in Australia in those days, like the 60s, 70s. It's a faraway place. And that was the thing. We sang Kibbe Simcha and Tari Brid. It was a song that was, uh, you really felt its meaning. So we say, got <clears throat> and that explains the Lashem <clears throat> in the Maimar Azal. Al Yiprotet Adam Mechaveri El Metech Dvar Alacha. Two negatives. Do not, we do not take leave of our friend. Only Metech Dvar Alacha. The Lacheda Avin Leim Bebekitza Yisrael could have been expressed much more briefly. Yiprotet Adam in affirmatively. Yiprotet Adam Mechaveri Metech Dvar Alacha. A person should take leave of his friend. Metech Dvar Alacha. Why is it so emphatic? A person should not take. Only the phraseology of the Maimon Azal is saying, if we just say a person should take leave of his friend, that would be saying taking leave is a normal thing and that's life. Well, you take leave, you know, say Dvar Allah. Al Yipot is saying, no, this is not, this is, we can't make peace with the Yipot and Bechaveda. That's not the way it should be. We have to be together, Yidin together, Abish and Yidin together. By saying it, one should not, other than it's saying that without the eights of, of the Dvar Alocha, then this, the whole thing would never happen. There never be a Yipat 
שלולי זה שמלכתחיל הנית אין דבר הלכה שמתאר כך זכריהו, אם לא את האמא של דה אאוטסט, 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 אם לא את האמא The mind of the matzav is that all you put it. The whole left shot is that you need the part of the chaveira. He said the whole possibility there could be such a thing when the statement says all it shouldn't is ain el let's say the chalia. It's only they should bring to a deeper connection. Adar chamo amalei elsev gimel explained at length. And again, the kavod asat simsum shayod the nasi asaf shot is explained the simsum, and that's the origin of the whole possibility of you put it all the chaveira. Why is the whole Tzimtzum Meshvila Giloi the Gilo of the Shleimus of Ein Sof? Kedei Sheyiyaz Achreihu. So the Rebbe says, it's not only that at the end we'll meet, but the whole, during this whole separation of Yipat and Adam, he remembers it. Kol's Manshin Himtzoyim Ba'ashlichus. Throughout the entire Shlichus, he doesn't forget. Ka'omur. As we said before, for sure he's going to remember him. And for sure the matter is clear, that they will see each other again. Like the song, he sent on the shlichus, and then not only temporarily, he doesn't achieve the rebuilding of the, of that, of that, uh, Medina Chareva, but he ends up in captivity. But the end is, for Chayzel of Eva Melech, he returns to his father, the king. Shahoz Asimchi Gdeile Ben Yosef. Then the Simcha is exceedingly great. The Simcha Zuparetz is called Akdorim, and it breaks all boundaries. Venimshach Atzmus Mohus, Ad Lamata Masarat Vachim, drawing down the essence of the Abishta, they went down to this world. Shayir Dirle is Barach, but Achtoin. Okay, so broad overview. And then today's story, in broad brush strokes. Yeah? There is a video of, of uh, the Rebbe seeing these people off. This, this, uh, and these beautiful, beautiful uh, diaries of uh, the Tchidim wrote of this Tishrei, this famous Tishrei, Tavshin Chafalef. This was the farewell for Brengen. The mind that Rebbe set for them, the first chartered plane from Etchisro. You see the video, the gem video. They were standing there and watching them board the bus. So before they board the bus, it's like 198 of them. There. They was motioning them to dance, and they was watching them with such, as they all describe, such fatherly love and looks of, of all of this, said in the mind, the empowerment, the zachreyu, the longing, the sense of shlichus, the separation is temporary. We're all destined to be reunited. We're to carry out the shlichus in their place. And here is where we got together the inspiration. It's all conveyed in the Rebbe's look, and the Rebbe's standing there, uh, in steps of 770. So if you, you see the view, it's a beautiful thing. In the windows of the bus, the, the women and children are looking through the last glimpses as the bus takes off. So I'll just begin the Chazorah then. So, and then the whole story there, they reminded him of this, uh, of this Pirish, Ashley over by Ishvla Yoshev Adam Shah. So that brings from the mind of the Fidik Rebbe that he said, Peites, leaving America, a Taich over here, that Torah, this was the Taich. Ashen Nosan, not Torah Sem, but Chaye Olam, not a Besecheno. So he Taich Chaye Olam, simply that that Torah guides us in the ways of the world. And in general, that's been Adam Lachavele. Avas. His soul is a keli to Avas Hashem. So therefore, leaving one's fellow, making the separation, 
So that, like our separation with Hashem, is undesirable per se, so too leaving our fellow. So therefore there's the need to make sure that, that, uh, that this, the connections are severed. And you have to give him something that he should remember. And he brought the teaching of the Baal Shem Tev right away, that where a person is, he's destined to come back a second time. Implying that the separation is temporary. So what's the, the, what's the, 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 so the divrei toiro is in, if he engages in chayy oilam, so the divrei toiro will maintain the connection, implying here also that is, if we're engaged in chayy oilam, the gabi de'evishter, in matters of the world, we still retain this connection. And the question is, why Dr. dvar halacha? The Rebbe says it's a, 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 a dual question. Why bchalal toiro? It can be anything. They should remember him. And in Torah Gufa, why Dafka Dvar Halacha? And also understand the connection to the final, the final uh, the story there you reminded me of the, of the, the Taich of Rabbi, of, uh, who was it? I'm forgetting, of Rav. Yesi Rabbi Hanina. Or I'll continue the Chazora tomorrow and we'll, I'll print out the uh, overview and make it easier, to, easier for us to get the overview.